Welcome to year three of the Denver Broncos franchise on Madden 20. It's great to be here to begin a brand new season in week one. We have the Denver Broncos and the Kansas City Chiefs. These are two teams trying to quickly move on from what happened a year ago. The Broncos had another losing season going just 6-10 and 10 with by far the league's worst offense, which led to the major change in the offseason and the acquisition to bring Josh Rosen to his third NFL team. The Broncos focused their offseason on rebuilding the offense, and they're hoping they can start the season fast as they're missing one of their top defenders, Miles Jack, who led the team in tackles a season ago. He's also our best cover linebacker, and we're up against Patrick Mahomes in the first game of the season. Everyone wants to know, will Josh Rosen make the difference on this team? It's his third NFL team, and by far, it's the best situation he's stepping into as a starting quarterback. The Broncos gave Curtis Samuel a $42 million contract. They have three new starting offensive linemen. Can they put it together offensively this season? The journey begins now. Kansas City has deferred to the second half, and the 2021 season is underway. Deion Price, the speedy rookie, takes it out of the end zone, makes a move, and is stopped at the 28-yard line, and it's officially Josh Rosen time. Twice he's been replaced by number one pick quarterbacks. Twice he's been traded. Can he now solidify himself as a starting NFL quarterback? Three receivers in the game for Denver out of the shotgun. Throwing on the first play of the season. Rosen completes to Curtis Samuel for a gain of seven. They waste no time involving Samuel. Now it is the first run of the season. A good one for Lindsey. He makes a move. Hits the gas and he's gone. Denver scores in two plays. Welcome to 2021. What a perfect start for the worst offense in the league a year ago. An offense that averaged 14.4 points per game. An offense that had a total of 21 offensive touchdowns. And Phillip Lindsay just matched his rushing touchdown total from last season. Unbelievable start. And now Kansas City, for the first time, takes the field with Patrick Mahomes throwing outside to Austin Eckler. That is a short gain. Some motion now from McCole Hardman, and they try a run, and Eckler gets stuffed by Will Parks. Here's the Denver defense. They have not changed much from last season. Damian Charles is now a starting corner, and they're missing Miles Jack for the first month of the season. Christian Baxter and Josie Jewell are now the starting linebackers, and we are tasked with stopping this Chiefs offense. It's Patrick Mahomes on third down, again short. Eckler on the catch, and he's brought down after a short pickup. What a start for Denver. Alrighty, back to Josh Rosen and the Bronco offense. Two tight ends now. Another run. Lindsey, what's he got now? About three yards up to the 30-yard line. We expect big things from this offensive line with first-round pick Norman Proctor and all-pro Trent Williams now at right tackle. The Broncos added speed at receiver. I can't wait to see what they have in store as Rosen's throw is caught again. Curtis Samuel for the first down. It should be fun to see how we utilize Samuel as we haven't had a receiver with his speed in this series. Rolling out now off the play action, a little short throw. Jake Butt has the ball ripped out, and Kansas City has it. It did not get out of bounds. Tyron Matthew was able to rip this ball out. Turnovers were a huge issue for Denver a season ago, and this really slows the momentum they built to start this game. Into Bronco territory. Mahomes and company have it. Give to Eckler. Out to the 40 and brought down after a solid gain. The Chiefs are coming off an 8-8 eight and eight campaign a year ago. That's a bit hard to believe as they have the first down. Mahomes to McCole Hardman. He gets some extra first down KC. Just outside of the red zone. Chiefs go tight on first and 10. Here's Mahomes outside. Touchdown! 
Tyreek Hill, and that should tie the game. Big answer for KC. Like I said, they went 8-8 eight and eight last year. That's after starting 8-3. and three. They lost the last five games to miss the playoffs. Both teams trying to forget last season. Josh Rosen and the Broncos take over, and here's the first catch of the year made by Cortland Sutton. Big year for him in a contract season. Rosen again protected. Right there again, Cortland Sutton, another first down. Rosen 5-5. Five of five. This is fun. Motion out of Curtis Samuel, and this goes outside. Nice move made in the open field. Royce Freeman down to the 31. It already looks like a massively different offense compared to a year ago. Handoff, good block, and there goes Lindsey again into the secondary. They'll bring him down inside the five. What a start in this first quarter. Broncos trying to score their second touchdown. Rosen to pass. Good coverage in the end zone. Rosen buying time outside the pocket. And he'll throw this one away. And Josh Rosen is down. He got hit throwing the ball away. And Rosen is coming out of the game in the first quarter. Making his debut. Second round rookie. Taquan Layton who had a great preseason. It's third and goal. Layton out of the shotgun. Pulls it down. His first play is a rushing touchdown. This will be a debut hard to forget for Taquan Layton entering for the injured Josh Rosen. And it looks like he's going to play the rest of this game. You never know what's going to happen when these games get underway. Kansas City again trailing. Now a good carry for Eckler who broke a tackle. He'll take KC up to midfield with a 31-yard run. A lot of offense already in the first quarter. We're not even 25% of the way through. And that's a good run now for Whitfield, the second year back. Gain of eight. Motion, and they give it to the rookie, LaMarcus Sampson, their third round selection. He's helping replace Sammy Watkins, who is now in New England. Start of the second quarter, Mahomes protected, and the open look to Travis Kelsey takes them inside the 30. Chiefs again driving, running with Eckler to the right side, another move. Now the speed to go all the way, 27 yard touchdown. You think this team misses Miles Jack? He was a big reason we had the number one rush defense in football. And we do not look like the same defense without him here. The game is tied. 14 all and Taquan Layton suddenly thrust into action here in week one. And it's Philip Lindsay crossing the century mark already. Some motion now and it's a quick flip. This is Dion Price. He's electric. And that is the first throw of Leighton's career. Those are technically passes. It's a 21-yarder. Leighton did play well in the preseason. And we'll see what they draw up suddenly as Leighton tried to keep this one. The opening was never there. I thought Leighton threw the ball really well in the preseason. But obviously, this is different now. These games count. Third and ten. Leighton from the pocket. Across the middle. He's got Cortland Sutton. Very nice throw. First down, Denver. The offense is on the move again. Samuel alone to the left. Plenty of time. Going for it all on this one. And it's ripped out at the final moment. Tyron Matthew defending Samuel. Third down for Leighton, again to the air, giving time, floating out, it's caught! Noah Fant, and another great throw from Taquan Leighton. Leighton in the offense, down the field, into the red zone, here's Lindsey. Bouncing outside to the left, and diving in! Touchdown! Number two for Lindsey, and the Broncos are back in front. We have three offensive touchdowns, and again, just 21 were scored a year ago. Kansas City trailing, and for the first time, we have sacked Patrick Mahomes, and there's Calais Campbell. The veteran replaces William Hayes, and Hayes led the team in sacks a year ago. Flag on the play on this third down. It was a great throw from Mahomes, 
and it's not going to count. Holding on Bill Williams, who was their first round pick at left guard. That makes it a third and 21. Again, airing it out, and the ball is knocked down by Christian Baxter. Denver takes over, leading 21 to 14. And here's Leighton facing some pressure as he floats it short. Samuel with it. Denver wanted to involve him as early and as often as possible. Royce Freeman is the tailback on this play, and he runs it inside. That goes for a couple. It's a contract year for Freeman as well. Cortland Sutton to the slot right. Blitz on Leighton. He's wrapped up on the play. Great coverage downfield, and he goes down out of field goal range. We're finally seeing Colby Wadman, who had entirely too many opportunities a year ago. This is bounced inside the 10 and down by Callahan. Great job pinning the Chiefs deep in their own territory. They run that sweep again. Sampson will not get outside. Stopped by Justin Simmons. Patrick Mahomes in his own end zone. Gets it outside the Travis Kelsey, and he's wrapped up on the play. Just a two-yard gain, and the Chiefs will kick. Here's a big opportunity for Denver, taking over two and a half to go here in the second quarter as Taquan Layton dumps it for Lindsey, and that's a solid pickup. Just ahead of the two-minute warning, they blitz Layton heavily, and he completes the pass, finding Dion Price, the rookie. Two to go now in the second quarter. Layton flagged down over the middle for Lindsey, and that would pick up 10 but it's holding against Denver, and this is going to be called on Juwan James. We'll see if the offense can recover. This is Leighton keeping. We will see some read option with him. The plan was to get him some playing time regardless of if Rosen was healthy, and now they're setting up a screen, and that just didn't work whatsoever. Good stop for Kansas City. The Chiefs saved themselves 39 seconds here at the end of the first half in two timeouts. Mahomes across the middle, Tyree Hill with the reception. And they'll use a timeout as Hill is grabbing at his wrist and he'll come out of the game. No Hill and no Watkins now for Kansas City. Mahomes given time. He'll air it out with this throw and found his target. That's Josh Malone having to step up and he does so in a big way. Seven seconds left for the Chiefs. Mahomes to Kelsey. Up to the 30. Timeout. Well done here at the end of the first half. And they'll try to cut into this lead. Chris Boswell is the kicker this season for the Chiefs. And his 46-yard try is through. And we have a 21-17 game. This has been a lot of fun so far. And this offense is finally showing signs of improvement. And it's been great seeing Taquan Layton up for today's challenge. The Broncos are hoping their improvement shakes up the AFC this year, but I wonder what's happening down in Miami. Second year of Jesse Heikinen, and they are making a statement right now against the Oakland Raiders. Quick injury update. Again, Josh Rosen not returning today. Tyreek Hill hurt his thumb at the end of the first half. His return is questionable. And the Chiefs will start the second half with possession down four. Running with Eckler. Stopped after a short pickup. Eckler the back on third and nine. And Mahomes sends everyone downfield. And he'll find Kelsey around midfield. The protection for Mahomes has been good. And they have two rookies starting up front. It's a pretty good offensive line here in Kansas City, and Mahomes is on target again. LaMarcus Sampson for the first down. They're getting their rookie receiver involved quite a bit. On the counter, another opening for Austin Eckler. Finally met around the six. He's over the century mark. Ball already at the four, and here's Mahomes feeling the pressure, and he goes down. There's Calais Campbell. He has two sacks on the day. Chiefs backed up. Now from the seven is third and goal. Mahomes to the outside. Kelsey brought down after a short gain. And the Chiefs will not be able to take the lead. 21-20. As the Broncos begin their second half. And there's a lot of trouble. 
Frank Clark brings down Leighton as he tried to roll out off play action. How aggressive do they get here? Backed up, a third and 19. Leighton short and got this one to Samuel, but that'll only pick up six. They'll have to kick this right back to Kansas City. Chiefs with two field goals on their last two drives, and they'll hand this one to Eckler. Another big opening. We didn't see play like this a year ago when Jack was dominating. First and 10. A cut left. Eckler across the 45. He gets seven yards. Again in Bronco territory. They'll throw this one to the outside, and a broken tackle. Nice play again, LaMarcus Sampson. This rookie's had some impressive moments in his debut. Kansas City again in field goal range. Eckler outruns Miller and again has solid yardage. This will be a gain of nine. Lindsey Whitfield now checks in at tailback and Mahomes quickly throws a strike. McCole Hardman for the first down. Chiefs back in the red zone. Eckler re-enters, play fake. Plenty of time to the end zone, Kelsey! No, did not get his feet in bounds. That was definitely close. Third down. They can get a first down inside the five and this throw will get it done. Josh Malone to the three. Kansas City trying to finish this drive. They go empty for Mahomes. He waits, spins and goes down. Sacked by Christian Covington. Can the defense get another red zone stop? Mahomes third and goal, 11 yards away from the end zone. And it's a short one for Whitfield. That will be another fourth down. And again, Kansas City settling for three. But they do take their lead, 23-21. The Broncos now trail. Can the offense get going again? Here's Leighton starting. He throws it across the middle. And Samuel hangs on. Nice catch for the first down. Motion now from Samuel. Leighton throwing his way. Flag down. It's a first down for the moment. And that's going to be coming back. Norman Proctor, the rookie, now gets called for a hold. Again, they fall behind the sticks. Second and 17, Leighton. Over the middle for Kari Bigby, who checks in. His first catch of the season gets eight. And that sets up a more manageable third down. Kansas City brings four. Leighton downfield. It's caught. Curtis Samuel in Kansas City territory. What a grab. This drive will continue. At the 43, Lindsey found nothing at his stop for no gain. Deion Price checks in. He's slot right. Heavy rush incoming. And the pass is intercepted. Leighton picked off by the Honey Badger. Tyron Matthew with another big play. They brought the house, and all Leighton wanted to do was check it down. What a break on the ball by Matthew. Unbelievable play by an unbelievable player. And Kansas City now trying to pad this two-point lead. They do have three straight field goal drives. Second down, Eckler. And for the second time in a row, he's bottled up by this Denver front. Now it's the defense needing to get a stop. Third down, Hill back in the game. Downfield with this throw, Sampson! Another big catch for the Chiefs. They're down to the 32 of Denver. Seven and change to go here in the game. Mahomes short, Hill makes the catch, and they pick up eight. The Chiefs have three tight ends in the game. They run it on third and short, and Josie Jewell makes the stop. The Denver defense played great run defense on this drive, and that will bring out Chris Boswell again. 42-yard try, watch out, it's a fake, and the Broncos are all over it. Rookie Eric McKinney is able to bring down Boswell, who had a wide open receiver downfield. I can't believe they went for the trick play. Denver still down by two as they take over and take one, Leighton's going down. They wanted to get the big play, you can tell, but Breland speaks, makes the play, and now this defense could get another stop. 
A third and 14 for Taquan Layton. He'll air it out and find Samuel at midfield. First down Broncos. What a play. Seven grabs for Samuel. Now it's a run. Big opening, Phillip Lindsay. That'll pick up nearly 10 as the Broncos close in on field goal range. Three minutes to go in this game. Leighton gets outside the pocket. He'll heave it downfield. Caught by Hamilton. First down. It's a gain of 20. What a debut for Taquan Leighton. He's done a phenomenal job today with multiple big time throws. This one is for the highlight reel. Broncos in field goal range. Running Royce Freeman up the middle and getting through the first wave of defenders. Gain of nine. Two and a half to go in this game. Leighton on second down. Throws up top for Sutton, who can't make the play. Well defended, it's third and one. I formation, Andy Janovich in, leading the way. Royce Freeman, first down to the four yard line. Three tight ends now for Denver. Trying to punch it in. Lindsey down to the two as the clock runs inside two minutes. Freeman re-enters. Second down. He's got it. And the Chiefs meet him in the backfield. Two defenders are there. KC uses a timeout and it's third down. They've got to open things up now. Leighton to throw. Third and goal. Caught by Sutton. He had to adjust for that slightly, but I don't think he was getting in regardless. And they're going to bring out Brandon McManus. Chip shot field goal, 20 yards out, and the kick is good. Denver in front, but they left Patrick Mahomes, 66 seconds. He brought the Chiefs down the field for a field goal to end the first half. If he does it again, it could win the game. Mahomes begins, throwing on first down. Dump for Eckler, made a move, and is brought down inbounds. The clock will run. Kansas City has only one timeout. Now 42 seconds left. Here's a completion for Hardman. Stops right at the marker, and they've got to get it going now. 27 seconds. Will Parks drops out, first and 10. Everyone downfield. Time runs out for Patrick Mahomes. He is brought down at the 24, and Kansas City has to use their timeout. Now they have only 10 seconds left. Mahomes for Eckler. He's tackled, and Denver's going to win in week one. They've shot Kansas City, and they open the season with an unforgettable win, led by quarterback Taquan Layton. What a way to start this season in 2021. Taquan Layton had to play a little over three quarters of the game, and he was phenomenal. He had a couple nice third down and long throws to Curtis Samuel that required precision. We saw him make the nice play on the move for Deshaun Hamilton. I love that call with the quarterback draw for his first play. I thought three yards out. Let's just go for it here. There's no better time for the draw to be called. Tyron Matthew tried to ruin our fun today. He was also great. He had the forced fumble, interception, broke up a potential touchdown for Curtis Samuel. But we got it done, and it was really the offense that got the win today with the fast start. We didn't have a great second half. We had like two drives where we took a sack, had a penalty, fell behind the sticks. So it just got kind of tough from that point. You could tell defensively we weren't quite the same with no Miles Jack. Austin Eckler had over 130 rushing yards. Can't wait to get Jack back, but it looks like the defense doesn't have to do this all on their own this season. I like how I was able to utilize Samuel a lot underneath, but when it came time for those big third down plays, he was up for the challenge there as well. There was a lot to like from this game. It was a very fun debut. We also get some good upgrades here. Hudson Brooks even gets a little boost. And that takes us into week two when we face the Baltimore Ravens. Miles Jack still three games away from returning. And Josh Rosen will be starting next week. He was playing very well, then he got injured, and while Leighton was fantastic, I still want to be very patient. 
I do want to stick to the plan there. I know that with the accuracies the way they are, at some point, those weaknesses do show up. They did not today. Leighton was fantastic. It was a great debut, but Rosen will start week two. And he will be up against Lamar Jackson and the Baltimore Ravens. Jackson has developed into a great all-around quarterback, and of course, we're going to have to be ready for his speed. There are going to be times where he's going to run, and we can't let him get big plays all game long. Marquise Brown is their top receiver. He can get behind the defense if given the chance, and they added Dalvin Cook in the offseason. He's a great running back, and after what Eckler did today, I'm not excited to face Dalvin. I'm also not excited to face this defense. They have a nice secondary led by Earl Thomas, and they have Michael Pierce at defensive tackle who can wreck our ground game as well. Week one was a lot of fun. Around the league, there were a few more interesting stories with Jesse Heikinen's four touchdown debut in his second season. Terrell Corville, the top receiver in this last class, had a 100 yard debut. Justin Colbert and the Saints almost pulled off a win. They lost by one to Philadelphia. Colbert had 249 yards, a touchdown, and the pick. We do not face Justin Colbert as a rookie. We do face Oliver Raymond, whose debut went a little better against the New York Giants. Raymond did have a touchdown, no interceptions in the game. And it's us and the Chargers each beginning the season 1-0. In Chicago, Drew Locke is now their starting quarterback, and they've only put up 10 points in their first game. Locke did have 280 passing yards, but was sacked six times, and the offense never really got going. Miami, on the other hand, they went 6-10 like us a year ago. I don't think they're going 6-10 again with Jesse Heikinen. Four touchdowns against the Raiders. It's not the toughest opponent. But I'm pretty sure Heikinen's going to have some more big games later this season. That is going to do it for this episode, everybody. What a way to start the year. Year three already a ton of fun. And we have the Ravens game coming up that will be posted Christmas Day. Thank you all for watching. Please leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and let me know what you thought of the year three debut. I'll see you all next time. Have a great day.